Hey everybody, I'm here at SIGGRAPH 2024 with Gerald Vanderiet from Manus. Uh, Gerald was really, really kind with us, and so I'm going to, full disclosure here, uh, he loaned our uh, program with a, a pair of Manus gloves, and these are motion capture gloves that capture finger movement, and uh, so we've got a student, John Gallinus, is working with them. We had them for like barely two weeks, yep. put together a demo, um, but I thought I'd talk to you a little bit about what makes these motion capture gloves so special. So we're, we're mainly capturing really fine finger movements, right? Yeah, that's correct. Um, you know, first of all, I wanted to say, give a shout out to you guys. Stellar work you've, you know, achieved in only two weeks when the preparation time was really short and I'm happy that we could provide. Um, but yeah, what you're seeing here is on John's hand is, uh, is a motion capture glove which can track the most intricate, you know, little movements in the market today. Um, it's a glove that's been there for two years almost, and um, we can, you know, we can track the really small movements. And in the demo that we're seeing today, John is also showing that how our gloves actually really come to, you know how they really shine and that's when you know the small movements and the interactions with props and objects come you know find place this is when our gloves really perform really well and you know a lot of the motion capture that I've done in the past is mainly optical systems so we've got an optical system set up just to track the position of the, the palm of the hand generally yeah. uh, but but the Manus glove is not an optical system and I've, I've seen like fiber optics and I've seen um, you know resisted like different kinds of materials that you know as they stretch and you know their electrical properties change but these gloves are completely different what what makes these different like what's what's on the underlying technology that you're allowed to share that makes them so special yeah well you know out there in the market there are quite a lot of options in terms of what type of sensor technology you want to use there's stretching technology there is you know flexing technology for for bending sensors um, we found that none of those technologies could offer you know the precision and the reliability that we wanted it to have so we came up with an electromagnetic field type of tracking and it is a real reliable type of technology it always gave us absolute positioning of the tracking of the fingers and we just turned that type of technology into something um, um, you know, something that we could use for mocap by, you know, readjusting our solver um, to, to make it work for that. So the way it actually works is we create an electromagnetic field from the back side of our hand. It's about 10 inches big and inside of that electromagnetic field we have you know the sensors which sit at the tips of the fingers. And that's really the only type of data that we track is the positioning of those sensors inside of that field. We can track that with one millimeter of precision at all times with no drift, uh, no drift over time whatsoever and then we calculate all of the joint angles and the position of the other bones that sit between the tip of the finger and the back of your hand, the knuckles. We calculate the, those positions and angles through an inverted kinematics uh, solver. Okay. And then what are the applications you're seeing this in? Because, I mean, obviously, you know, we're using this in a character animation scenario, but there's a lot of other ways that this can be used, right? Yeah. So in character animation, our gloves are very popular because they bring expression to any kind of character like never before, right? And in, in that sense, we really enable storytellers to also do something on a nonverbal side of things. Um, but apart from that, you know, when it comes to interacting with props, you know, they're really good because if your 3D asset matches the dimensions of your real life prop, then we are going to guarantee that, you know, the interactions with your prop and the animation of that is going to look clean. Um, other markets with that, that we tend to is life sciences, where people want to do... Um, um, 
rehab and uh, other types of um, um, you know, healthcare related things. And one of the newer markets that we have been tending to lately is the robotics markets. And I think, you know, most outstanding case in there is Tesla robot, which has also five fingers. It has to resemble a human. And our gloves have been driving those fingers because our gloves uh, make the difference between interacting with an object in the correct way or letting it slip from your hand or actually crushing it. So that's what our gloves do. That's, that's so amazing. There's so many different things you can do with it. I think I'm, th this is great. I'm going to wrap this up for now. Uh, we're going to we're going to need these for a little bit longer. Oh, and I, and so we'll, uh, I think I'm just going to pack these away and, and take them home. And uh, and we'll have to create some more videos and, and some tutorials to show people how to use these things. Um, but but thank you for taking the time here at SIGGRAPH and uh, letting us uh, show these things off. And uh, good luck with all the rest of the, your conference work. Yeah, yeah. Well, thank you. And I. I I can't thank you guys and the talented people that you have brought here from the Drexel University as well. Um, I look forward to see the amazing creations you guys are going to show with our gloves. So if anyone sees this and wants to get in touch with you, is like LinkedIn the way to go or is there some way, how would they reach you? Um, I'm very active on LinkedIn, but uh, what you can do is send out an email to me and that's Gerald Vandriet at Manus dash, no, not dash, minus, meta.com. Um, or you can send an email to sales at manus, you know, minusmeta.com. We're not a part of Meta, but, you know, Meta is a name of, uh, a part of a name of our company. Excellent. All right. And I'll include those links in the description. Again, Gerald, thank you so much. Thank you. All right. Have a great day.